Hello and welcome to another GCSE Geography Help video. We're still looking at living in an active zone and today we're looking at monitoring volcanoes. So why should you monitor a volcano? Well monitoring a volcano can sometimes give a short warning before an eruption to evacuate the surrounding area and hopefully save some lives. So how do you do it? Well scientists that monitor the Mount Etna um, volcano measured the amount of sulfur in the air using a coast spectrometer and on average a day near the mountain there is about 4,000 tons of sulfur in the air but on an eruption day there is 20,000 so the scientists can measure how much sulfur there is and if there's an increase they can maybe predict in an eruption they can also climb the mountain or from a distance take a picture using an infrared camera and that can see where the magma is and uh, if there's again likely to be a eruption and lastly they can use seismometers to measure earthquakes around because um, this can be unstable uh, the if the volcano is unstable it might not always but it might trigger an eruption so there are some of the methods of how they measure volcanoes. Uh, next time we're going to be looking at how um, to reduce the impact of volcanoes after it's erupted.